Opening weekend, it's far more than just the start of the duck hunting season. It's a time where mates from all over the country come together at their duck blind or my my of choice. Guns, ducks, dogs and banter set the tone for a weekend filled with fun. In this video we've tried to capture the full experience, so settle in and enjoy our version of the opening weekend experience. to the Mai Mai on Friday morning. Um, a few ducks around, more than last year, probably seen about a hundred on the ride in. The boys loaded the um, trailer up last night with tea tree. So we're just going to brush up this whole side here needs a bit of work um, and get all set up while the boys are the rest of the boys are working today. We try and avoid working on Friday because work sucks and hunting ducks is way more fun. And part of duck shooting, opening weekend in particular, is the setup. So we've uh, dedicated the day to enjoying brushing up and setting the decoys and watching the ducks flying around. It's pretty exciting. Better stop video and start helping. Is the dog? It's really, a bit chubby this year too. Excited. <laughs> and the boys, the old dogs. Can I go to? Toby will probably turn up. Kia ora. Yeah, Toby will like pick me up. Hey, to be here. Tasty pie. Heaps of ducks. Yeah. Dino pie. You going, Tony? Good. <laughs> <laughs> There's about a hundred ducks just here, I reckon. Sitting in front of the yeah. That's what that good year happened, eh? It's looking promising, Pete. I don't want to. I want to get. Let's not jump to conclusions, but. Uh, I think we're doing better than last year anyway. Yeah. I think you're G -day. I think you're G -day. Uh, too late. I'm fully G'd. Oh, this is like the years that we got heaps. Is that many around? But this, this we won't be getting as many though, because the limit's been reduced yeah, this year. Only about 48. Only. That's with six people too. Tomorrow we're pretty sharp. What, what, Don't get eight. Let's yeah. yeah. not Stop get ahead of ourselves. Remember when you can get like twenty? Remember when there was no limit? Phone, I think you no, can. No, yeah. no limit. They stopped the no limit though right. because people just never shot. Oh, the dogs in the water, Sam. That's the right. It's right. gonna get tangled in the thing, isn't it? Sure, we're right. Tilly, she's yeah, tilly. whining and stuff at the car park. She's so excited. Cujo. Already tangled in the Yes, she is. It's a Chesapeake. <laughs> it's whining, eh? It's excited and so fat. Excited. Fat and excited. Toby now he's just done a bit of work, so he didn't want to, like me and Tony, he didn't want to do any work on the Mai Mai, just wanted to get the benefits of the whole thing. So here it comes. Interesting tie we're running there, boys. Into it. Looks like a Toby plan that tie, eh? Yeah, so we've seen the white one, eh? How's it going? What do you reckon, Toes? Looking a lot better than a couple of weeks ago. What is? Did you come in here with us? Yeah. Oh, saw five <laughs> ducks. Oh, oh, oh my god, look at that. Oh, we are. Oh, no. Same as the didn't see that, we didn't see that. Here we go boys. And girls, whoever wants to watch our videos. Oh my god, look behind you. Look up here. 100, does that get you G'd up, Tobes? Yeah, fully G'd up now. 
I see you got wait. The, I see you ripping the new hunting top. Yeah, I get in trouble if I don't wear it, eh? Yeah, you're not allowed to come into my mind. Nah, got, our, got our white duck just swirling around us. It's got a target on its back. That thing there. Oh, it's like five different trees. All into twine. Trying something different this year, just from the afternoon here, but having a uh, bit of a platter there with some various small goods and cheeses and stuff. Got some of our honeycomb there. Um, so, <clears throat> yeah, it's a little bit marginal for this type of men's thing. So, if we see our neighbours coming, we've got a plan to just shuffle it off into the Mai Mai. We'll pull out <laughs> some beers. Pull out some, yeah, some beers and. Some pornos or something. Tony's got his Tony's got his camo on for tomorrow. He's ready to go. We're gonna throw that on the neighbor's mai mai on I'm top of their mai mai tomorrow. I'm after a colourblind duck. Yeah. They're very rare. <laughs> <laughs> Probably still get them. Uh, that white one. That'd be pretty obvious. Still dark. New tradition and maybe. That white the, one the, would be colourblind. The duck. cheese board the yeah, night before. Um, these are like teat wipes for when you're drying off your cows. You clean the teats and they're absolutely full of alcohol and we find you can make a real mean cup of tea with them, eh? Soak them in the water. Mean. What are we actually using them for? Just wiping your Wiping hands. our ass. <laughs> it burns a little bit though. <laughs> it does, eh? I have yeah. done it. Ooh. Good for Imagine ring retention. Or something. <laughs> what? Ring retention? Ring retention. <laughs> Pulls it all in. <laughs> it's 2022, opening weekend, Friday night. The boys are on. Nana died this week, so a bit of a memorial. Every year will be will be the uh, remembrance of that. So yep. first of May. Yep. But Was it? We're not. Was that the death date? We're not excited about that, but we are excited about duck shooting. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, things are looking good. There's a few ducks around. A couple of right behind us. Yeah. Um, the Ooh, white duck that we've spotted a few times. In the river. Uh, um, circling around our <laughs> pond. So that's the target for tomorrow. If we get that, she's going to be chahooing like you've never heard Hopefully before. Hopefully it doesn't come in too early, eh? In the dark. Yeah. Oh, that would be tragic, eh? If you didn't realise, you shot the down. white duck because it was dark. Oh. Yeah, you even Could know, possibly eh? happen, eh? Mm. Oh, that that comes right in us. Oh, no, come in, come in. Oh, 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 almost straight inside, oh. Blaine. The boys have been me, Noah, and Harry came in early and set everything up. So it's all ready to go now. We can relax, enjoy the evening. Toby's cheese board that he's. Uh, do that. We demolished it, eh? Smashed it. Basically, you guys are renowned for coming early. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's part of your young people's thing, eh? We, all, we always do. Me and Tony, we come later. Every year. <laughs> <laughs> we wait a while and then we come. We take much longer to come. <laughs> but yeah, we'll uh, probably see you tomorrow morning because. Nothing left to film here tonight, really. No. no. Nothing left. Hopefully, hopefully there'll be so many ducks. I can remember back in the old days when Tony and I were younger, we shot so many ducks, and it was that that the only way to cool your barrel was to go out and dip it in the pond and then come back to the mine mine. Got so hot. Hopefully, but we're only allowed eight ducks this year, so. <laughs> yeah, yeah but we weren't very good shots. <laughs> yeah, third person, so for us that's probably. Limit was only six back then. <laughs> Yeah, it'll take us a few shots. If you've watched our videos in the past, we're not the best shots in the world either. Some years not too bad, eh? We've improved. We've improved. I found we get better shooting with more ducks. Because we you're not freaking out. Not so excited. Not so yeah, right. trying to all these ducks. People. It was like the year we got the most. We didn't miss many. No. And you know, I didn't shoot as many shots. That's nothing. It's like the first two shots of your gun, like just trying to beat the other people yeah. and get it down. And then your last one, you're like, I better aim on this one. No, but I think we had a better plan. When once we decided instead of carries. instead of left and right, we decided closest and furthest because it's way easier to decide. Besides, what I reckon is, maybe we you know, just have a policy of you know, because like Toby, yeah, don't Toby's rush like you. old Uncle Si. Every time a duck goes down, he got it right. Hundred mm, percent. So he's obviously missed. the best shot. He's obviously the way <laughs> the best shot. 
So Toby's got to take the furthest away duck every time Sounds to, good to, to me. challenge himself. Now Toby <laughs> shoots these really um, not good long range bullets. Mm. Does he? Why? We, I've got three and a half inch twos. Because you bought them cheap ones. <laughs> oh, did you, did you have no, no. He didn't. He's, they were on. He always two. shoots the not the expensive mm. ones. They're like 10 years old. Yeah. Kind of the well, the box I've got mean, is probably yeah. 10 years old. Nah, we bought it the little COVID year. No, Billy, no, no I've got years. a box that is probably oh, 10 years old. Jelly T. James, he used to just fill his up with rice and then knock them down and then I take them home and fatten them up. I reckon if we filled Toby's bullets up with rice, he'd still get them all. Oh, oh I got that one! I definitely <laughs> got that one! As long as we didn't tell him there was rice in there. No, I reckon I'll figure it out pretty relatively fast. Shooting one on the water, yeah. right? It's like, <laughs> Sometimes it's like that does tick, happen tick, though. You shoot them on the water and the pellets are all around them. Remember that, remember that, remember that explode. time Toby did, did a shot, there was a duck on the water and he did a shot. Put it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shot, we, put it up and we thought like, he missed it by miles. What the yeah. hell are you shooting like three <laughs> metres below the floor? I watched that video. Yeah, yeah. yeah same, I watched I it just yesterday. want to say to all you people out there duck shooting, you know, if you're gonna, if you're gonna have a good day, enjoy yourselves, if you're going to do the drinking side of it, keep it till the end. Of the morning? No, of the end of the day. <laughs> or the end of the shooting. It is. It can be at the end of the morning if you stop shooting. It's yeah. just guns and alcohol. That's just eh? They're just... They don't mix, so. You know, mistakes with guns cost lives. Mistakes with cars cost lives. Mistakes <laughs> camoing the my my cost ducks. Hey, Tony's got a story. Have I? Which he was one? cutting down this tree by a fence and it fell on the fence and then skidded along and smashed him in the face. Oh, oh that really I didn't even notice face. the bruising. When did that happen? Anzac Day. I thought you got in a fight and I didn't want to say anything. Got <laughs> grills, like so being in the, the trenches, eh? So what happened? Don't cut trees beside fences. So you cut it down and it went boom. And the wire no. came up and got you. No. no. The tree. Hang on, let Hang him on. tell the story. I haven't got a stick, but... Oh, you're getting a stick. Can you make it work with that? Oh, oh holy. Yeah, yeah here they all come. Oh. I can break it. Oh, he's the oh. white one again. Okay, the okay. Okay. Right. okay, here comes the story. Here's the fence. Yeah. Here's the tree. Oh. Was Osh involved? Mm, don't want me to hold this one. Yeah, it was quite low, probably for the size of the tree. And so I was... Oh, you can hold that one. <laughs> I was cutting down here. Yeah like far enough away that I thought it would just go like that. Toby. <laughs> <laughs> but when I cut it, it went like that, but then it went like that. And... <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, really? Did you knock you out or anything? Oh, I was close. <laughs> oh, it took me a while to come around. my shit together. Did it hit you right there on the nose? Like straight up like that, oh. like a total uppercut. Fried nose and stuff? Oh, shit, yeah, I had my... Thing like, mm -hmm. Did you record? Did it you think about that guy couple. that was fighting that guy Fury? But it only just happened that fight. That was Fury guy. Must have had a good uppercut because <laughs> I didn't get knocked out. But it hurt. <laughs> Did you um, record it in the health and safety book? <laughs> How can we get a photo on um, Cool Story, bro? South to America. <laughs> <laughs> Enough times you gone past. You did a trade yeah. the one the other day. Oh yeah. I, I took like, a photo of, I've got a photo of my phone but before the actual bruising because my whole face was like black, like this. not just my eyes, it was like oh. right down to here was black. Shivers? Yeah. Didn't even know. I did one the other you day. You don't need as much face paint anymore. The um, bloody, brown around your a whole lot of wind and there's a whole lot of trees around and then there was a branch <coughs> on this tree. And so I went underneath it with a tractor, it was on a hill like that and I only had a short chain, I really needed a long chain. And I couldn't be bothered getting the long chain, so I hooked the short chain to it. And I couldn't really see up in the tree because the canopy was over. And as I pulled it down, yep. one big branch yep. up and the tree came down and fell on the tractor yep. and smashed all the roof and smashed all the dashboard and nearly killed me. So close. The good thing about farming is ACC like levies no are the cheapest. Crap. It's probably eight years it's been like this no, sort of They're the dearest. I know. Bit it's of a like, vibe. I just, we were thinking reason. about it like, how, what are the chances of that? <laughs> oh, oh, look at that. Imbeciles. Imbecile. Building. Building. Is it? Things were looking promising for the next day, so with spirits high we hit the hay hoping that it would be raining ducks when the sun came up the next morning. After an average at best sleep, it was time to get up and get ready for the shooting.
Okay, I can hear a few geese coming here. We're all go. It's a few minutes to go now, so we'll just see how I cut it here. Uh, te atua, e whakapai, uh, ki a mātou, kimi kimi, e au te raki raki e tēnei rā. Uh, God bless our hunt today for the ducks. Uh, nā mehe nui, uh, ki a mātou tūpuna, ki ora kei te mahi o tēnei whānau. Uh, just acknowledge our uh, ancestors um, for their, their work in us and gifting us this um, um, love for hunting. Uh, ko, uh, ko a aki, 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 amen. 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 That's my marriage. Let's kill some ducks, boys. This is drama. There's people shooting the nice guns down. This is drama stations. Oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Can you believe now? Take the turn the lights off. How do you turn them off? Yeah, Just take the clamp off. Get up there, boys. Shooting time. Needless to say, we were all very keen. However, Pete's eagerness to get on the board got the better of him here and led to the first bad call of the day. Yeah, I'm front, 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 front. Shit. Up, up. Who shot it there? Who shot it there? Dad. That was ridiculous. That was not even in range. With that out of the system and a bit of a tune up from the rest of us, it was time to get into some real shooting. Yep, above us, above us, above us. Stuff, boys. That was better. Warmer. Yeah. Yeah, one above us. Come around. Come around my side. It's still high, but it's coming. Around. Nice. Out. Ready. Ready. <laughs> Good shooting. <you. laughs> That's somebody's limit. <laughs> Did you? About seven now. Um, we've got eight down so far. Got a good mob of four came in, and then it's just the rest was single. So it's been going all right. It's quite foggy though, so that you can't see them until they're real close. <laughs> So I'm waiting for the other one to drop. Three, yeah. I got one of them. I only got one shot. <laughs> to be fair, we they were both in range for a long time. Yeah, but you should have been earlier. Yeah, that was a bit of a stitch up. Look at that feather. What do you reckon? Got a few. Oh, 
I know. Someone shot though, so we kind of had to shoot. Sam called it. Oh, no. It's hard. Well, it's just because they other people shot. I don't know. Like, we got two. Only two, I, I reckon. I got three. I didn't get the one I was shooting at though. I got one. <laughs> it got minced at the end. There was just so many shots going on. <laughs> Did you not even fire? I was like, no. Peter was just into it. I powdered it with my last shot. Just boom, 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 boom. <laughs> this was one of those classic situations. When there's ducks all around the swamp, every pond's calling to try and pull them in. You think you're just about to get yours on their last pass, and then some drop into the neighbor's pond and he shoots, and the whole thing's spooked. But that's just how it goes sometimes. Yeah. Over the back. Ready? Shooting them. <laughs> <They're> dead. <laughs> You're gonna run out of ammo, eh? Got a whole that one's the one you need to get again. Someone needs to finish that or are we gonna Good shooting boys. Go around the back. Around the back. Your corner, your corner, Harry. Harry, your corner. Maybe in range. Fuck. It's so annoying. Nice, nice, we got all nice. four. Two were right down a bit, Sam. Yeah, down yeah. a bit. That was awesome. Good shooting, boys. Yeah. They were quite far, though. Well, so good call when you good get shooting them, there. Yeah. Got them both. Always a good call when you get them. Even though it's uncomfortable shooting around the thing. Harry's side.
Is that you? Yeah. Who shot then? No, I called mine. Just, no, <laughs> just claimed it. Mine. I thought it'd be better just to let one person shoot. Just claimed it. He said, oh, this fog is like impenetrable. The ducks must be, the ducks must be flying above it, I reckon. Whenever it clears, we get a few ducks and then all of a sudden this fog comes in. We just can't get any. It's hard. It's, it just makes it hard, eh? Can't keep, it, keep an eye on them either. Can't see them. Can you see them in a circle? No. You hear them, you hear them, but you can't see them. <coughs> makes it tough, man. Not as tough as being in Ukraine at the moment. over your side if they are coming. I think they've gone to someone else's. I could have, but no one else would have been able to. Someone's going to shoot them. I could have shot at them, but no one else would have been able to. But we can do a radio report. How many? Two greys. Yeah. I don't think they saw us, I think they just were wanting to go into this. Do you want to give me a caller just to let you guys know if I see some? I will just blow it once. Looking in. Breakfast. Breakfast time. Kransky buddy. Cheers. <laughs> no, bear stick buddy. The best part about having a dog, and a my mind like this, is that we're able to shoot without going out and retrieving them every time. And if we do lose track of a couple of ducks, she usually finds them in the long grass when I walk around with her. Get it. Get it. Get it. Bring it in. Good girl. Thank you. Murphy's law means, Good however, job. that when I'm out there retrieving, the ducks start circling the pond, and we have to sit tight so the boys can get a shot. I shot oh, at the first the one. The I oh, shot at the, the first one. Because I like the only oh, one who shot, shot the first one. I think we should oh, have. You did too. I think we should have a fight. Yeah. <laughs> I thought no one shot the <laughs> first one. You got it before me though, Tony, a little bit. Yeah, I reckon. <laughs> one was, was pretty easy, yeah. Probably could have shot those two the first time they yeah, came they through. Came back. Yeah, and I didn't want to. Like, you know, sometimes you, if you just shoot them when they're passing, you know, like mm. you, you're not giving the other guys in the ponds an opportunity. Yeah. And yeah. I always like to nice try and be fair to everyone, you know. So yeah, we made a good call there. In the there was Perry somewhere. Yeah. Mm. Just here, I, was, I was like, I'm just going to shoot the far one. <laughs> Take them, take them, take them. No. They seen us now.
Yep. Oh, it was like one shot, yeah. three ducks dropped. Yeah, this one almost hit the my mind. One did, didn't it? <laughs> that one literally flew this far from Harry's head. Yeah. That? That's what yeah. I was going to have. So cool. I got the real oh. far one. Yeah. You guys saw oh, it. I thought, bang, oh, that's dead. That's dead. Yeah. I thought I'll get a shot at this one. Did you guys shoot the. We all, me, you, and. So us three shot, shot at different darks. Yeah. They always went down. I shot middle. Yeah, I shot middle. Yeah, I got yeah. the far one. That was, so, that was the three from before. Yeah, I reckon that was the three from the two. They must have went real far and then came back too. Nice. Very yeah. nice work, eh? Good girl, Tilly. Come here. Good girl. Bring it here. Bring it here, Till. One at a time. Good girl. Good girl. Double retrieve. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. After the good start to the day, the sun came out and the birds were a bit more edgy. With all the other shooters in the swamp, it's hard work to bring the birds in close enough to shoot them. But that's all part of the challenge, and when you do bring them in, it's so much more rewarding. You're coming here, aren't you? Straight at us. Get ready. Get ready. Uh, I don't know if they're coming to us, eh, boys? There's two here. Oh, yep, yeah, there's four here, four here. Cupping, four cupping. Yep, 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 yep. Some over there. Hurry up. Hurry up, what are you doing? Here we go, boys. This time, boys. Ready, 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 ready. I thought we got all four, we only got three. I missed my first two shots and then. I reckon I did it right that time, eh? I'm pretty sure. I'm scared that one got hit. Yeah, I'm Because I moved from it. We had a pretty good morning this morning. Got quite a few ducks who were quite happy. We, uh, it was quite foggy, but it's ended up pretty good. Um, so we're just putting on a pork roast now. This is a nice pig that uh, Noah got about three weeks ago from his uncle's farm. So you haven't just, I'm not just putting it on now, it's been on. Yeah, it's been on for about an hour now, so. Low and slow. Low and slow, so we're going to cook that all day. And um, then we're going to do potatoes and coomera. Potatoes and coomera with it, and pumpkin, and some peas. So, should be quite good. Um, together, we're going to do this one. Yeah, it's going to be a bit of a this is lamb shank casserole, but I actually think it's venison. It something we prepared earlier. No, it's not goat. Do not bring the goat. Venison shank. That looks like Tilly's vomit. Yeah, but it isn't. I can mm. tell, I assure you that's very tasty. So we might heat that up a bit too. Not yet though. Have it as a sort of a gravy. Oh, a bit of a jizz. Yeah, a jizz. So. A venison stew jizz. Hopefully, Jew. Will, hopefully we'll get this going like all day and it'll just be just just as soon as we finish hunting, shooting tonight, um, that'll be ready. So. Finish it. 
Well, we've got the decoy good. Am I the only one that shot there? Yeah. yeah, I think you got it. Uh, that's my first duck today. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty happy. It's a partial one. Yeah. First day. First duck of the day. First one that you know that you got. You probably hit lots of others. I sacrificed the. I sacrificed shooting by filming. Once he I was like, oh, he's not getting away. I'll just let someone shoot. Did you film as well? Back end yeah, but yeah. but behind it. Oh. Kidney shot. Taking it at the back end, Pete. Took a big load from behind. Me. If they miss with my first, but second yeah. one I think I got, but we all shot. Both up and then they're just hovering. I couldn't yeah. even see them because I was trying to sort stuff out. Did you get that on video? Go get them retreat. Someone made a huge noise. Yeah. We should have shot at them. Yeah. Might have been our opportunity. Where'd they go? Definitely could have drilled them. Where are they? They're all grey. What was that noise? Oh, I see them knock something over. Or... Not the can over. <laughs> They're pretty close. Yeah. Ready? Over the back, over the back, over the back. Ready, ready, ready. Yup. <laughs> I'm glad I had them on. <laughs> Good shooting. I got the front left one, I think, but someone else might have been shooting. A few feathers falling down off those ones. Satisfied with the piece of good shooting there, it was time to get out and clean up the pond. I grabbed Tilly and headed round to the far side to pick up any ducks that were still floating around or in the edge of the grass. Tilly's about eight years old now, so she's still pretty keen and pretty able, but definitely slowing down a little bit at the end of the day. Having a half decent dog like Tilly makes hunting so much better. It's rewarding seeing her work and retrieve the ducks, but it also stops as much wastage as possible. Once I was satisfied that we'd found all of the ducks, I headed back to the Mai Mai for the evening shoot. Guys missed that one. <laughs> I definitely missed my first shot. Mm. <laughs> Second one felt pretty good, but everyone shot at the same time then. Oh, good shot. Oh, good shot. I shot that would have missed the That was a nice shot. Nice shot. Here we go, boys. Ready. Ready. Ready.
That's one of those ones that the high <laughs> ones. That was a <laughs> <laughs> It's a drake, wasn't it? That's yeah, it was a drake. <laughs> Good shooting. Fine, when you get them chests on like that. With all six yeah, shooters yeah, going to shoot at them. The it's the only time you can take one like that. Way. Everybody just shot at the same time. <laughs> yeah, right as like. <laughs> right as they crossed. They were both next door to each other. Yeah. Surely, surely, surely. Me and Tony were saying the same thing though. We're like, oh! Swinging up on them. <laughs> <laughs> that first, that last, second to last cross. Lucky it was dark. <laughs> Should we finish on that? <laughs> that was a good one to finish on. That was going nowhere, eh? <laughs> no, neither. That feeling all night. I just saw it wasn't getting any momentum. It was just going straight down. Quite a few around. How's that meat looking, Pete? Does it work? Oh yeah, it looks pretty good in here. So I just put the vegetables out of there, took them out of there to make the gravy and put them in there. Vegetables. Vegetables. Just gonna use a bit of my pea juice here. Pea juice. I don't want to eat your pea juice. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you find today, Pete? Yeah, it was alright. <coughs> Quite much better with these earmuffs. Oh. I've never had earmuffs before. And I find it. Always a little bit stressful. You hate the paracaller, normally. Yeah. Happy with that, boys? Yeah, it was a pretty good day. Eh? It's a bit of a fog in the morning, which is a bit of a pain, but cleared up, and then the birds actually came in quite well in the evening, afternoon. So it was quite a lot of singles and stuff, but actually ended up getting quite a few in the end. So pretty wrapped. Happy is. Pete's scratching away in the background here. I'm trying to make some gravy, trying to... it's going to be pretty stewy. Stewy gravy. Because you're actually using a stew. Using All you're doing is reheating a stew and somehow yeah. saying it's going to be gravy. Well, it's how you make gravy. We just need a bit of flour, but we haven't got any flour, have we? No. It was safe to say we were stoked with how the first day had unfolded. We enjoyed a good meal and some good company, reflecting on all the events of the day before climbing into our sleeping bags to get a few hours sleep before doing it all again the next day. If you want to check it out, go to our Clark Boys Hunting YouTube channel to see how we got on for day two.